Canada has just launched a new immigration pathway that is actually beginning to welcome foreign workers and immigrants to Canada from spring of 2024 if previously you've been looking for ways to migrate to canada and you have not been able to secure and mostly you're looking for opportunities that will get you to the rural immigration programs in canada where they are always welcoming immigrants foreign workers to canada as i said there are two new pathways that are open right now and they are very exciting and i want to share that with you today canada is a very immigrant friendly country that is always welcoming immigrants from time to time it can also be very quite challenging to secure something for yourself in canada because of the very high competition and that is why anytime i find canada opening its doors to immigrants and foreign workers in the case of the rural immigration pathways i tell people please grab those opportunities run as fast as you can uh, you can and do your applications as early as you can because the earlier you do it the better so before spring gets here because we are two months away from spring of 2024 i want to share with you these opportunities because i know it will be opening in the next two months and i want you guys to be informed so that by the time we are getting to june july you're equipped with information that will enable you to migrate to canada under these two amazing pathways in a press conference earlier today, Immigration, Refugees and Citizenship Canada, IRCC, announced two separate new immigration pilots, one for rural communities and another for, for francophone minority communities across Canada, while adding that the existing RNIP will transition into a permanent program. In our press conference today, Immigration Minister Mark Miller emphasized the value of rural and francophone minority communities across Canada. He noted that the regional immigration plays a key role in strengthening the economies, connecting businesses and employers in remote communities with the skilled newcomers they need to thrive. According to IRCC, explain, accordingly, IRCC explains the decision to introduce these new pilot programs will help attract and retain skilled foreign workers in rural and francophone minority communities contributing to the economic and linguistic vitality so these two are programs that are going to enable you to move to canada and uh, in them as i said in the rural communities the first one is the rural community immigration pilot this pilot program is being implemented according to ircc as a way to ensure that rural communities continue or being able to assess programs that address labor shortages and help local businesses find the workers they need thus far canada's immigration department has not provided details about the pilot program because as i said this is starting in the fall uh, in the spring of 2024 so we have around three or four months to go much like the rnip ircc says that the pilot is intended for newcomers who can definitely live and stay in these local communities and help the rural communities overcome critical labor shortages and that want to live long term in these communities remember there's uh, what has been there previously the rural and northern immigration pilot the IR, uh, ircc's new pilot program the rnip will effectively serve as a direct replacement for the rnip because pilot programs can only last a maximum of five years and already the rnip has already elapsed the five years that is why they have introduced two new pathways okay to immigrate to canada through the rnip candidates must meet a various uh, personal and work experience related eligibility criteria while also receiving a community recommendation from a designated community economic development organization among the eligibility requirements for the rnip candidates must meet either of the following sets of federal criteria one having a recommendation from one of the designated communities two having one year of eligible continuous work experience in the past three years a minimum of 15 60 hours or having graduated from a public funded post-secondary institution in the recommending community possessing a genuine job offer to work in one of the designated community uh, possessing a um, meeting the language threshold required for the noc skill type having sufficient funds to settle and support themselves and intending to live in the community the other one is the francophone community immigration program ircc new francophone immigration pilot is aimed to, uh, at helping the federal government add to the number of french speaking newcomers settling in communities outside of quebec aiding in the economic development of francophone minority communities uh, and helping restore and increase their demographic weight so 
if you know you've been looking for opportunities to move to canada and previously you have not known how to go about it this is a very good chance for you to be able uh, to relocate to canada and you will understand a lot on what is required of you and what you need to do this as i said this is something or the pilot programs are kicking in from spring that is june july so you should be on the lookout because uh, you have been given the requirements or the eligibility criteria so you should look out and see if whatever you're looking for is for you using new programs and new pathways to immigrants or foreign workers they are doing that so that they are able to cap um labor shortages in this community and also to introduce more foreigners more french speakers uh, in communities and in the rural communities mostly in canada because in most cases most people are moving to the urban areas and the country does not want to forget the rural areas because they contribute a lot to the growth and the economy of canada if you're coming across my video for the first time my name is candy i share information matters relocation abroad either to work for study for conference please go down below remember to subscribe turn on the notification bell leave a comment if you have any please do remember to share that way you'll help youtube recommend this video to more people who are looking for this kind of information and you'll help me also grow this community i offer different services cv reviews one-on-one -on -one session personalized job applications i've written two ebooks specializing and explaining how you can secure caregiving jobs in usa how you can secure and how you can hunt jobs abroad and those two ebooks are also available on my seller shop all the information i talk about on my videos is always linked on the description box down below all the services i offer is also the seller shop is down below under jocelyn candy seller shop thank you for always tuning in i really do appreciate you i do not take you for granted see you tomorrow be safe keep safe and until next time thank you